Hello everybody. You're looking at the base of the 360. Now typically we don't see much worm castings in the bottom but I did fill this up uh, quite a while ago with just a bunch of shredded paper and it is due time to take all of the castings out and then move those worms to their new home. Okay so I'm going to take the lid off or the ring. The bottom of these 360s come with this um, ladder and that helps the worms get from the bottom to the upper trees but you'll see that they like to stay down here so that's why I added all of the shredded paper there still is some paper in here but it's very dry so I'm gonna put it I don't know I'm gonna put it right there so yeah this uh, I'm gonna give a little shout out to Ann from uh, plant what's her channel plant Ob obsessed plant obsessed she just got a 360 and I said that was a good um, good for her to put the scraps on the bottom because the worms like to go down here so I'm gonna scoop it out just with my hands and again I haven't put any food down here it was just shredded paper and whatever worms are in here they're gonna go into the the blue bin and then we'll get that one ramped up with a few thousand worms, I believe. So that's how my, that's how big the casting pile is, just from the base here. And this was from shredded paper, which there's still some pieces in there that you can see. So I'm going to harvest everything I can here. I'm not going to bother separating the paper. That will break down next year or whenever I use the castings for my seed starting or on the garden beds. So these castings are a lot finer than in the black bin. So I think it will go quicker and we'll be surprised as to how many worms are in here. Okay, so this didn't take me as long as I thought and I really hope I didn't miss a lot of worms. They're kind of tricky to see in the, in the castings. So we've got a small little worm ball there. 27 grams so yeah it's just a nice tight ball 27 grams oh there's another little guy there I'm sure I missed a few but these worms will be going into the blue bin and then we will see what kind of castings they can produce everyone thanks for watching and stay tuned to the big tray that I will harvest hopefully in the next day or two. Bye for now.